update. I got a new property here in Windsor. This place is pretty awesome. Uh, previously listed at 1.1 million. I have no idea where we're going to be price wise. It's on four acres. Look, there's a bunny. Yeah. Anyways, lot 1.1 million. It was last listed. Uh, it's a little over 6,000 square feet. I'm going to take you inside here in a moment. Again, this is a brand new assignment. So we're just getting in. It's a little rough. Uh, the yard hasn't been maintained very well, as you can tell. Um, but it is absolutely gorgeous out here. It's, uh, it's nice. So we're going to go in the lower level. Again, the entryway here. Off to the left, there is a wet bar over here, which is real nice. There's also a three-sided fireplace here, as well as a built-in entertainment center, so forth and so on. Great window exposure. Nice alcove area here. There's the wet bar. And then over on this side, there's another larger room and a nice theater room. This looks like it has about a 10-foot screen in here. Nice private area. There's also a closet over on this side for all your gear. There's also a step up here for theater style seating. This looks like it was an office, possibly storage area. Damage. There's definitely some water damage here. You can tell where it's come from. There's actually some mold on the ceiling. So we'll be getting this remedied most likely prior to listing, but it could be an as is. So uh, we'll keep you posted. This place is huge, guys, so I'm sorry. This is going to take a little while, but it is a bomb home. Sorry about the uh, smoke alarms, too. There's only about 500 in here, and they're all beeping. It's your mechanical room. Two 50-gallon water heaters. A nice Lennox furnace. There's also a water pressurizer here. Bada bing, bada bing. Pretty nice bathroom down here. Everything's very nice in this home. There's slate, granite, tile, accents, high-end fixtures, high-end lighting package. Good stuff. Oops, I turned some lights off. My bad. This is one bedroom down here. There's also some water damage here on the floor, which, of course, comes up to the ceiling, which was somewhat remedied. Sorry it's a little dark, but um, definitely some damage here as well. I'm sure that will be accounted for in the price. And then you have two bedrooms down here. These look like they were these were children's rooms, um, and that was I established that before I actually saw this stuff on the wall. And in just a second, you'll see why. It's kind of a Jack and Jill bathroom gig going on here. Sorry, let me get a light. And here's the reason why. No, you have your two sinks. Yeah, it kind of makes sense. Nice tub. Bam! Mini me toilet. That's for the little guys and girls. So that led me here into the next bedroom. Um, so two bedrooms down here. Storage area, theater room, living area. Pretty darn nice. This would be enough house for most people. Um, but we're going to head up to the upstairs. And apparently the security system is going off. You guys are going to think I broke into this house or something. Not the case. Here's the culprit. All right, sorry about that. Well, we might as well start here in the master bedroom. I'm going to back up a little bit. So you have a grand entry into the master. Nice art niche right here. Off to the left, gorgeous master bedroom. His and her sinks, both sides. Gorgeous, huge tub, marble accents, and also your stand-up shower. Shower seat, very, very nice. Private toilet, huge walk-in closet. It's like a run-in closet. Yeah, I know that was funny, huh? Anyways, and then over here, and I've been carrying this soccer ball around for a while. So we have a gorgeous view, huge master bedroom, which leads out to a deck out front. We're gonna go out there in just a minute. Um, but check out these views. It's gorgeous up here. 
And then there's a private area here, almost like a nursery. And I'm going to get my soccer ball. All right, let's go off to the rest of the house. These are the stairs we came up, just to give you some perspective. There goes my soccer ball. Large dining area here. Uh, I think I mentioned this property was on four acres. If I didn't, it's on four acres. Here's the deck. Beautiful, beautiful. I'm going to run you guys through the rest of this. I know this is taking a long time, but this is an awesome house. Check out this kitchen. Huge slab marble, gas, Viking range, all stainless appliances, tons of upgraded cabinetry. It's awesome. And then you have kind of your family living area with a fireplace. Again, awesome views, tons of natural light, beautiful windows, artistic accents throughout. Little Michelangelo. I'm just on a roll today, aren't I, guys? Well, I'm stoked. This is an awesome listing. This is a dining room. Ooh, colors are funky. Another bath here with a stall shower. And then, of course, laundry room. More storage. Sorry, garage. This garage is massive. It's a four car garage. There are some items that need to be trashed out here, but I mean, this is a huge four car. You could fit four cars and a whole bunch of gear. Hear my echo? Woo! This place rocks. All right, we're gonna head back this way, guys. I'm gonna kinda cut through the kitchen, give you a bird's eye view at some of this stuff. And we just hit seven minutes. If you're still with me, I really appreciate it. But like I said, this place is awesome. Well, I want to find a buyer. We want to get it sold quickly. Let's do this. Let's make a deal. And I'm Jeff Rubenstein, realestateruby.com. You can also check me out at REO Ruby. This is a bank-owned home in Windsor. You'll have to stay tuned for more info, but contact me directly. You can send me an email at jeff at realestateruby.com. Thanks for joining me. See ya.